This is an excerpt from my Sussex County Hauntings and Other Strange Phenomena book about my own personal experiences. In 2002, my business partner Dawn and I proudly opened Ellie and Dawn's Great Finds, an adorable antique and consignment shop. A little old man ghost with a black coat and hat visited me often when I was there after hours doing inventory. He never bothered me, only merely seemed to observe what I was doing. One night, Dawn and I were there together after hours, standing behind the glass counter when he suddenly appeared. Dawn! Dawn, I whispered loudly without taking my eyes off him for a second. Huh? she answered back. Do you see what I see? I asked. She looked up from what she was doing and was silent a moment. I don't see nothing, she said. There is absolutely nothing there. I refuse to see it. Clearly, she did see him, and he remained there, observing what, what we were doing. Then I never expected Dawn, considering she chose not to believe or see this ghost, to fess up to having experienced anything on her own. When I started writing this book, she opened up to me. You do remember my story, she said, don't you? No, I said, I only remember that one time together when he showed up and you kept telling me he wasn't really there. Oh, Ellie, she said, I thought I told you about it. Well, you know how I often would bring Grandma Rose with me at times I worked and sit her down in that antique rocker in the front of the store? She'd eventually fall asleep and I'd step out to go next door to the deli and buy my coffee and favorite muffin. This one time, she continued, I stepped out for a moment to go to the deli as usual, and as I made my way back into our shop, I saw what I thought was Rose in her black hat walking around the circular rack in the back end of our shop. I stepped through the front door and suddenly remembered I didn't have Grandma Rose with me that day.